All right, guys, welcome in. Welcome. This is day two, episode two. Not too sure how I'm uploading this series to YouTube yet, but this is how we're going to be doing it so far. We're going to see how it goes. We're going to test it out. So, in day one, uh, we got started. It was a rough start. Very, very rough start. Uh, let's go and have a look at what we've got over here on our character quickly. We haven't got much. Um, at all, we're gonna manage to get an AKS 74U. Manage to get a key card, some Fakond, gunpowder. This is all stuff that we're gonna need at some point for selling on the flea market. Um, nothing too big of a deal to be getting with right now, actually, at all. Um, we've got 53k. We've did a bit on the hideout. Um, let's take a quick look over at the hideout. I think we managed to get um, a few bits started, but we're gonna start doing our tasks. Um, oh, we've got a few things here to actually, um, oh god, upgrade, do I need that? Because uh, we've got our lavatory, the reason for the lavatory, we need to get to level 2 actually, what are the requirements here? Water collector, um, we need level 1, um, so we need to go and do an, an interchange run, um, the reason we need to do this uh, the water collector is locked. Why is that locked? What do I need for that? Okay, so we just need to make a little bit of money, basically, because... Oh, I need to upgrade. That's probably just wasted my money, but I think that's now unlocked the water. Oh, no, it's still locked. Anyway, we can go make some money now. We've got a scab to go and do. Um, we're going to go and hit up Interchange because we need to get these items. Um, we're looking for some Salewas, so we're going to go and hit up the um, medical stuff as well whilst we're on there. Uh, other than that, that's, yeah, our stash is obviously level 2 because we've got the slightly upgraded version, which is going to help out with our storage space. Um, other than that, we're going to get warmed up. We're going to get straight into it with a scav over on interchange. Um, did I hand in that task? Oh, we need to kill five scavs at customs, which would give us a bit of money, some reputation, uh, and things like that. Other than that, guys, let's hop straight in for the raid with our scav. Starting day two. Oh, main menu. Escape. Scav. 
And yeah, we're gonna go on interchange. Let's go and get some. Let's go and get some bits that we need. We need some cash. So we could do with getting some medical spawns. So if I go over to here whilst we're doing this, we're gonna pull up this, and then we're gonna go to. Um, we need a customs. No, interchange. Interchange map for Tarkov. I kind of like this map myself. Wait for it to load up. Zoom in. So we're looking for some medical spawns. So if we go down here, we got the medicine boxes, is which what we're after. Uh, not there. There's not much there, really. So, I believe this room to be locked. Why is it doing that? It's doing it anyway. So, this is upstairs at the mall. We could do a check-in out there. This is across from um, the tech store where we can get some GPUs and stuff upstairs. This could be pretty rough. Medical room. This is locked. We're going to have to go and check out the... Oh, why is it doing that? It's weird. Uh, there's a couple of med spawns outside on the ambulances. Because we need them salewas. For the task for therapist. Again, you want to get your tasks done uh, pretty much as quick as you can. And start using... In, investing into your um, hideout. So you can get like scab jump boxes, mag boxes... And things like that. Oh, my chat box is gone. Where's my chat box? There we go. Roman. How you doing, dude? How's things, bruv? Good to see you. To see you nice. Uh, Alt-tab quickly. It's not letting me do it. Uh, and... Let's hop right in here. So we've spawned underground. What have we got? We haven't got much. How long have we got? Wrong button. 12 minutes. So we need to be kind of quick. We should be okay. As 12 minute mark, we shouldn't have PMCs. Players should be dead. This is going to get a straight up and in there. We need to check that... Someone's above. I think we're going to go this way rather than that way. We heard that guy above again. We're not looking for conflict here, alright? If you're looking for Call of Duty streams and videos, this is not the place right now, okay? Oop. We're looking to get whatever the hell we can get out of here. Make sure we're on full auto. This doesn't look like it's been looted, which is good. Oh, it's been looted. Gunpowder, though. Uh, we'll take that, because we're going to need it. What I'm doing, I'm just going to loot these and drop them, just so I get the XP, okay? So... Oh, you don't need XP. I'm on my scav. I keep forgetting. Lol. Lol. So, we need that gunpowder. We haven't got much storage space, so we do need to try and find a player. See if there's another gun here. What's this? Is this the Mosin stock? VPC stock. I don't think I can take that, unfortunately. Uh, again, these couple of components here. Don't really need the rails right now. It's so hard to see, man. Like, I'm sat in front of the windows. I need to get some, like, blackout curtains. Uh, again, just ex examining things. Checking jackets for keys. Money. There's a key. Sam 303. I think that's decent key. Um, we can have, have a look at the end of raid. Crackers we don't need. We don't need food. We've got enough of that. Alright, let's go and run to the middle. Look for some scavs bodies. 
We're looking to get a bag. Um, a vest. This is probably the most common place to find a dead body and stuff. Checking all the floors around Mantis. This is a med spawn that we're going to go and check in a minute. Um, so the raid boss killer could be around here. People usually generally die around him. Which doesn't look like he's been in here. He could be Mantis. That sounds like above. I can't see any dead players, which is... Crazy for interchange, to be fair. That was a player. Hopefully he's got meds. We're going to check his pockets first. As that's where people generally keep the meds. Yep, perfect. Bandage, please. Nope. Alright, so we're going to use that quick. I don't think I'm bleeding, which is lucky. We've not lost an arm. We're just going to move around the corner a bit here. Not stand in the open. Heal up again a bit more. Let's reload. I think I already did. Uh, so alt clicking is going to pick up the items. Uh, search this. Examine that at the same time. Oh, a safe key. That'll be all right. Uh, bam. I think someone's above me. Again, we want this bag quick. So... Alt click. We'll take that knife as well. We can't. Yeah, we can. What's he got in here? Rubles, GPX phone, MRE. I think this is just food and drink. So we've got a couple bits there. Just search this jacket quick. He's just searched that jacket. Uh, we're just going to reload this quick. What rounds we got in here? Tracer rounds. And then... We're going to search these so we can find nuts, bolts, things like that. Bulb we need for the hideout for lights. Uh, that can be traded in for grenades at some point. We need that. If that's a bar to trade item. Ooh, what's that? We'll take the... GM count I'm not going to pick up right now. It's not really money worth... Matches we don't really need right now either. We've got a bag and a rig, which is ideal for getting us kick started with this one. Hard drive, again, we don't need that really right now. We haven't got the loot space for it. And we are on a scav, so we're in here to get whatever we can. I think these are possibly being looted. Looks like it. I've never seen these so empty. But again, it would usually say close if it's not been looted. Oh, another key. So, customs key. That's a good key. That's the office key. Customs office key, I think. Another key. Room 218. Too sure. Hard drive. Just gonna loot this side here, and then I think we're pretty much gonna get out. Cord. Um. Mm, yeah, we'll take that. I 
What have we got here? Croquant, don't need. Another key? Wow. Gas station, T plug, we don't need. And search this last one. Anything? Duct tape. Um, let's get rid of the peas. Peas are terrible. Um, these duct tapes can be used down the line for getting like. Uh, a sick case, which is where you can store like documents, keys, dog tags, and things like that. So, and you need about twenty of them. Okay, let's go and get out of here. Let's go and extract. Um, extract for myself is going to be top left corner or bottom right hand corner of this map. We're going for the railway exfil. Uh, the one in the bottom right is Emacom. Emacom. Uh, if I'm correct. No, never mind. So there is a hidden stash just further down there. Across from like a ute. Sorry, not a U. That's Australian. So, a thing that you can do here is you don't have to jump over these fences. If you just sprint at it, they just run straight over. So you can save yourself a bit of stamina there. Yeah? Uh, there's some suitcases there that we can usually loot. Well, you can get, like, cat figurines and lions and stuff, but we haven't got the, the room right now. We don't want to be greedy. We just want to get out. We've got three minutes here. Most likely, this hidden stash here has been looted. If it says close, it's being looted. Oh, no. Let's have a quick look in this one, and that's it. Nothing. It's been looted, so the other ones have been looted, most likely. We're just going to get out of here. Good little raid to start off. One player kill. Or scav kill, should I say. Tell you what. One day I'm going to be drinking my coffee and someone's going to shoot me in this game and it's going to go all over me. <laughs> but if you are enjoying um, this series, then make sure you hit that like button. Um, a, on the stream, or once this video this stream gets uploaded as a VOD. We're going to be doing this as often as we can. Um, I think probably like one hour, two hour sessions. Or I'll break it up into two videos. One gets released in the morning. One in the evening. Not too sure how I want to do that yet. But yeah. You still here, Roman? You lurking, dude? We're out. That's what we want. Yes, extracting. Easy. Nice first raid there. Yep. What's your plans today, dude? Have you got work today? Just working? Yeah. Well, I'm off today. I've just had a um, morning out with my dad. Uh, well, he kind of rang me and he was like, Hey, what are you up to? Um, I was like, nothing much, really. Um, I'm just getting stuff ready today. So I cleaned my room, organized it. Oh, we need to have a look at what these keys are. Uh, went for breakfast. Went for a fresh trim. Another um, gunpowder there, which is nice. Uh, milk, we can save. Squash. Um, duct tape, we can pop up there with these items. This can be where I put my scav stuff. Uh, keys, did I put them down the bottom here? Yeah, keep them together. Uh, we've got some rubles there. Um, best thing you can do, there's probably people in the chat now like, why aren't you control clicking and stuff? Because like, one, I'm making sure I'm keeping things organized in my stash. The moment it gets unorganized, it becomes an absolute pain. Uh, we need this out, this out. We can use that on our next run. 
Um, middle mouse click will fold weapon stocks, so they take up less space. Uh, that can go down here with this. Um, we did drop our other mag, which I kind of wish I kept. Um, Packer armor, again, it's not the best. It's level 2 armor, but again, it's still better than nothing. It's going to take that one round of something at least. Um, and then we can sell a couple bits of that. Other than that, we make sure we empty our scav and we can get ready to set up our PMC. Don't know if I'm doing anything afterwards. Well, I mean, I've got work early in the morning. I'm busy today, though. Like, as soon as I've done this um, two-hour stream, I've got to split it up, make it into the videos. Um, so that's going to take me to about three o'clock-ish uh, when we finish streaming. So it's just a short stream today. Um, and I've got one client at the gym to go on personal train. And then we're going to train with my cousin and my best mate. So, yeah. Pretty busy day for me. And then work first thing in the morning. Um, character. Ooh, we're only at 10k rubles. Ouch! Uh, we're going to take that off. Uh... We're going to sell this because we need the money. Uh, we need this, this. We're going to take a little bit of healing and a bandage. Um, I'm not OG, so... All right, energy and hydration. Played Among Us yet? No. What's Among Us? Question mark. Um, do you know what I'm going to do, actually? We're going to keep things as organized as I can here. So, uh, that can go there. Fold that stock there. Um, how much is it going to cost to repair this? 3,000. Eesh. Um, we kind of want to try and get some SKSs. It's a party game where you try to figure out who the killers are before they kill everyone. Hmm. Among Us. I'll have to check it out. Um, we'll keep that. Sell these. Kedder can go down here. This is some of our stuff that we could sell when we're level 10. Tashankas, splints, bandages. We need Salewas. How many do we need? Just examine these quickly. Middle mouse click in there. Um, Ragman. <sighs> We're running low. We need... Uh, so, dealer's fence. Sell to you. I've got loads to freaking examine with this guy. But again, this is all XP getting us closer to leveling up. It's like $5 on Steam. Alright, I'll have to get it downloaded then. Because I've been playing that Fall Guys. That's a pretty fun game, to be fair. Just examine a little bit here. Not doing too much, guys. So if you're getting bored, just hold tight. And um, This is part of something you've got to get done. Good to know that they sell on there. I forgot about that. Oh, it's Fence. Yeah, I watched that. Yeah. Um, Alright, so let's see what I can sell to prepare here. Because um, we've got a couple guns now, I'm going to sell this. Because we need money. We're going to sell all this. BS rounds we need. Yep, keep them. That's a decent key right there. That's going to give us some money. Um, I need to go to Ragman. Oh, wait. Examine these quick. Saw there are cheaters flying. <laughs> yeah. Literally, I was like, what the hell, dude? Um, go click. Good. All right. Um, therapist. Can't buy anything. We're keeping these because we need them for our, our um, 
Fence, skier. There we go. Uh, sell. What can we sell to you? I think Ragman buys stuff more. Yeah, there you go. Bit more money there. Right, 26k. We're on the rebuild. Um, we're gonna take in, I think, the AKS 74U because we need bit. We need to kill a lot of scavs. Oh, not a lot of scavs. Um, it's just an easy gun to fold up as well, nice and small. Um, hopefully, we can get a bigger bag. Armor's good. Um, other than that, oh, nope. Forgot. Let's go. Let's go and hop into it. Customs, get these scav kills. Make some money, hopefully. Um, 5.30 in the morning. I could go and do that. Yeah, let's go do that. It's going to be a bit dark. Well, not dark. It should be about sunrise. How much is it going to be to ensure that? We'll ensure the weapon. Other than that, everything else is fine. We want to try and see if we can get guns back. In fact, Roman, get your uh, point on this one. What do you reckon? Do I... Alright. Um, upload these into, like, our sessions. So people can come back and watch them. And break it down. So it's easy for people to find where we're up to. Because I want to make, like, a, like a series sort of thing. I think that's a better idea to do. Our sessions at most. Okay. Yeah. Done. Yeah, so it's literally just going to be like the streams posted, if you get what I mean. So I want to under... So I want to understand this concept or that. Yeah. Like, my focus, um, if the concept is longer than an hour, it's part one or two. Okay. Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah. Man, I'm addicted to coffee at the minute. Okay, focus here. Avoid player conflict. All right, we need scav kills. Oh, yes, it's dark. Uh, we're on the trains. Confused myself here with where I am. Okay, yeah. Let's just crawl and run. Somebody can spawn on our right there. Let's make sure we're on full auto. That's a good point, actually. So Scav was on that roof just there. You saw him run. And um, what we're going to do is I'm just going to loot this body quickly. So yeah, user has loot. You need them for the... Uh, this is a quest key we don't need right now. But we can get that down the line. We're going to go run this way. 
I think that sniped Jesus. That grenade made me jump. So it looks like I'm a bit exhausted there. Close that just so I know who's coming. Uh, search this jacket quick. Again, we need bolts. Good. Matches we don't need right now. We could take this ammunition. PS ammo. That's going to be for the SKS. Uh, nothing else really in here. Usually food and drink. Uh, we're going to loot this med boxes again. We're after Soleil was here for... Um, we'll take a bandage. Splints. I'm probably going to end up dropping most of this. So again, just some more PS ammo there. Uh, a couple jackets here. Cigarettes, we don't need them yet. Uh, it's Tashonka, most likely. Or sardines or something. But we're going to go up straight upstairs. Um, in this room, if you don't remember from the first one, you can find um, documents... I think it has possibly been patched. You can find them on the floor. And they're worth like 150k. There's a, a car kit. Pineapple juice is good. Paper we don't need. There's a bit of ammo there again. Um, that's pretty much it. We don't need that milk. It's going to make us, that'll make us uh, thirsty. Uh, what we're going to do, though. Can't see anybody over there. We're going to search these. Again, if you're on your PMC, make sure you've, if you've not looted a singular item, that raid, pick it up and you can drop it just so you get a bit of extra XP. For example, let's find another piece that we've not found yet. Just to show you what I mean here. So, matches, I've not picked up yet. I get XP for finding it. If I loot it. Oh, I've already looted one. Never mind. Point not proven. <coughs> Let's see here. Here we go. So, examine it. Keck tape. We get XP for looting that item. Because it's something that we've not picked up yet. Ooh, hand drill, cord. A, what's that? Power bank? Ooh, I've never actually seen one of them. Uh, sometimes money can spawn on here, but this is the room that we're after. And the room, the next room, is we're looking for Salewas. Uh... This is augmenting, most likely. Yep. They're good. Uh, checking on here. You can find, like, morphine sticks, painkillers. Silly was as well. Don't look like there's any there. Let's have a look on here. What's this? Morphine. Nope. Doesn't look like a good room today, this. Uh, again, ammunition here. Silly was... Wow. None today. I found four in here the other day. Okay, so what we're going to do here, unload all this ammo, and then we can stack it, make more room. Uh, get rid of that. Unload that. Uh, get rid of that. Bam. Again, just getting rid of the bits that we don't need. We don't need all these bandages. Uh, splint will keep. Four, five, six. Um, we want to try and put singular items in singular box, singular boxes. Um, what else can I put? I'm going to put that in here because I think it's worth a bit more than what half of this is worth. Again, you learn your value of items and stuff as you go through. Uh, PRS rounds aren't the best, but right now, I'm surprised no one's come this way yet. So, uh, we were unlucky with our 
Let's just check for sniper scav here quickly. I don't think I'm going to be able to see him there. I can't see him. He is or was on that roof. He could be behind that chimney stack. But you can get sniper scav up there on them. Also... Up there on them. So. Plan of action here. Is we're going to run for this middle part. Because we need scavs. There's usually a lot of scavs over there. So Last time. We died coming down them steps. Because we didn't look for this sniper scav. So. Doesn't look like sniper scav is around here. We should be alright. Let's have a quick look, he's not up there again. So this is really quiet round for this area. Can't see sniper scav there. Customs is such a dangerous map right now as well. Like since they've added in this whole new expansion. Uh, we're going to have a look up behind here again. Make sure that scav's not around. We need four scav kills. That's what we're after. I don't know where they are. I could be a dead player in there. But I didn't hear shots, so I don't think it's going to be. Yep, someone's been through here. So we're going to pick up that shotgun, again, just for a bit of money. Um, I think this bag's bigger than this one, to be fair. Yep, so what we're going to do here is, uh, we're going to pop these in here. This should fit in here. And as you can see, this has got a lot more loot space than this. So by putting these items that I've got here in here... Drop that. Um, we can save ourselves a bit more room. Uh, six, seven. Done, done. Bam, bam. Uh, like that. Good. Bam, bam. What else can we put in here? Uh, we'll keep the power bank in here for now. Keck tape can go in there. Bulb. And that tape can go in there. So it gives us a bit more loot space now. We'll check his pockets quick. Nothing. Alright. Let's move on around again. Again, just checking for sniper scav. It can spawn at any point in the game. There's usually one scav in here. Another dead scav here. Oh no, this is a player actually. Player died. So we'll take his tag. Um, I can't take that Mosin, unfortunately. We'll take the pistol. Probably LPS rounds here. SMB rounds, even better. Again, just using control click there to pick up the items. So, one way we can check how he died is by just lying down. And I'm going to inspect his dog tag. So, yeah, he was killed by a, uh, a scav. Wait. Ooh. Hmm.
So we don't want to get caught on this. We don't want it to ring. Again, we've got two mags. We're good. Make sure that we're on auto. So press B for that. That was me getting caught on the fencing. So, raid boss can spawn here. Um, always check on the right as you're coming through here. Players like to cross in through this door and these buildings. So far, it seems pretty quiet. Uh, let's see if it's been opened. Nope. This is a dangerous place to be here. But we're going to risk it. So again, we're just wiggle peeking here. Doesn't look like anything's here. This is such a quiet day today. I should not have. Oh shit! They've just spawned. Yep, this is a raid. This could be the raid bosses. Yep. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to pop morphine. So in that way, if I get legged or anything, it's going to help. Oh, no. Looks like it could have just been a scav. I think we're quite lucky there. Unfortunately there. Doesn't look like he had much. Uh, we're going to take them glasses. Take the cap again. Everything here that we're taking is that extra bit more loot. I thought I heard two scavs. So I think there's another one around. Alt T to check my mag. We're about half. Just over half. Just check the back of here. And again, let's move on. So we need three scavs, okay? So I'm just going to reload here so we're ready. Um, move that there, move that there. I do think there's another scab over here on the right, though. Not too sure. Uh... So, I've got to be careful here. That was a sniper scav, but there's another... There. Um. Got them both. Nice. So, I need one more scav. Just check his pockets. Uh, we'll pick that up. Again, it's meds right now. We need it. Terrible rounds. We'll just get it for the looting experience. And it looked like Sniper Scav fell then. Uh, so we're going to go and check him because he could have some good sniper rounds for us. 
That was a nice clean kill for both of them then. Uh, Snapscav can spawn on there as well. Just being careful here as we go through into this next compound. Check behind us. Make sure we're not being followed. Checking again for sniper scabs up here. Also, one can spawn up on here. That's the one I killed, yeah. Seems okay so far. We just need one more scav. I'm hoping he fell to the ground here. Yes, he did. Nice. That could be an SKS. Which is exactly what we're after. Okay. Um, so we'll drop that. Take that. Check his pockets. He'll have PR, PS rounds, hopefully. Nice. Yep, perfect. Stack them. Pop that in there. Scav vest we don't need. Armor we don't need as well right now. Okay. So. What I'm going to do here is probably take this out. Uh, press R, R to reload. And we're pretty much good. Um, nine rounds. Plenty of rounds to go with this. That don't go on there, just so you know. Health-wise, we've not taken a hit. Alright. Um, oh, yeah, where have we got to get out? ZB-101 or ZB-103. So they're still open. So someone's on the mounted gun in the new customs area. I might keep this out, actually. Ideally, we need this last scav. Oh. That could be someone going for extract. Hmm. So, we have got the dead scav or something here. How do I want to do this? We're going to jump over here. No! He was looting there! Damn, dude! GG. We just lost all that. Oh well. Unlucky. Sad face. But that's partly because, one, we don't have armor. Ooh. That was unlucky. Imagine if we traded again. <laughs> <laughs> like the last raid. I mean, we got some decent XP there. He headshot me. Uh, we killed three scavs. So we need one more scav for that task. Unfortunately, if we could have got out of that, that would have been a lot better. Um, 7,000 to heal up. What I'm going to do is actually... I'm going to have to heal up on that. And it's got to be another scav run. 
Again, try and get some more gear ready for our next PMC run. I'm legit shaking right here <laughs> from that then. All right. Um, again, we've got some more PS rounds here. Um, which is good. Power bank. I'm not too sure how much that sells for. Um, but we've got some stuff. Um, let's go do the scav. It should be up now, I think. Yeah, what have we got on the scav? Ooh, looks like a decent AK-103 there. Um, what do we need again? Soleil was... I think that's all I need. I don't think I've got any more tasks. Let's go and check, actually. Um, we could have leveled up there. Um... So I'm level 4. We might have a couple more tasks. Let's go and check that out first. So, tasks. Active. Again, yep, I just need one scav, which is annoying if we could have got that one there. That would have unlocked another one. Uh, we need three Salewas. That unlocks at level 5. I don't think I'll get anything for you yet. No. Mechanic. Uh, level 5. And Ragman, level 15. Okay, so let's go scab it up. I think interchange might be the shout. But then again, if we can get the Salewas. Customs, we're going to go do customs, scav. Customs is actually a really good place to go and get money now. <clears throat> We're finding it so hard to progress here. But again, the, like this is the, the way of Tarkov is for beginners. Yeah, like it's alright going to watch, like, I sit and watch Pestily, I watch Shroud, and they're like fucking god-tier players, but there's people that come into the game who have no understanding of it. That's my issue early on, and it is the most hardest game you can get into, but it, it's a game that... It's crippling, but so rewarding at the same time, which is what I like. I find it best if you're having a bad day on it. Um, play a couple, like try and play at least like three or four rounds. If they're all bad, take a break from it. Don't keep going into it. You need to make sure you've got that positive attitude. I've got hiccups here. It's like, I mean, if you, from the first day, like, we killed two players, like, level 40 odd, um, and unfortunately got killed by a third party, um, and we would have been kitted, we had, like, Gen 4 armor, it's like, level 5 class armor, like, dude, that was, that was good. All right, here we go. Creating loot pools, and then it should be pretty much straight in. So, as a scav, obviously it's preset loot. Focus here is the Salewas. Uh, by me killing scavs here, I'm not going to get any reward towards my task with Propor, because, yeah. The only thing you can get rewards for, uh, rewards, um, tasks are done with, is by, like, looting items that you need. Um, like, in-game loot. Okay. Looks like it's another rainy session here. Green gunpowder. We need that. That's pretty decent. We've got some meds. And we've got a lot of ammo right here. Um, let's see what ammo we've got in here. Alt T. T rounds isn't the best. So they're tracer rounds. Uh, we'll just buy the water towards dorms. Uh, how long we got? 
half an hour, so most likely dorms has been looted. Uh, everybody always runs along the wall towards dorms. Safest route round is literally by the road through this ditch. Okay. You've got your cover either side. You can go left or right of the hill and make sure you're prepared. Again, just because we're a scav, we don't have to be worried about sniper scav. We are safe. Let's push through. Run round. Um, doors are shut. Them shots sound like they're towards petrol. Make sure we're on auto by pressing B. We put our gun away by accident there. We're going to rush third. Someone shot me from behind. Uh, well, what we're going to do is search this bag quick. He's got some stuff in his. There's a gun. Yep. Nice gun there. Uh, examine. Someone's starting to stash here. So, that's the gunshots. From behind. Just check if this has got any mags in it. Half. Unfortunately, no iron sight on it. Um, how do I want to attack this? If he's dead, there's probably someone else in here.